Hi corset lovers, it's 1.30 a.m. and it's Wednesday the 10th. So I'm gonna put my corset on and head to bed. I have my frownies on. Anyways, that's not the point. The point is, is that today was my first day I did a water fast, like a whole, whole, whole day, whole 24 hours. I did, however, take some Excedrin because I had a horrible migraine still. It's it helped. Yes, Papa. But I am gonna put my corset on right now and head off to bed because I wore my waist trainer all day today when I was like doing, I went walking and I all please don't. I went walking and I also went to the gym with it. And then you know I took my shower and I was like, hmm, let me put on my corset because I'm gonna wear oh my god, he messed me up. I was like, let me put on my corset because I'm going to do my water fast for a total of three days. So again today and then it ends Thursday night. The reason why I'm putting my corset on is because I feel like this water fast is going to kind of help me revive, regenerate, restart, refresh. And it is really hard, but I know I can do it. So... Actually, I don't know if I'll be able to sleep with it like this, but we'll see. Okay, see you guys later this morning or afternoon. So this is how I'm going to be going to sleep. Um, I have this tank top over my corset because I don't want to, you know, ruin my corset. But this tag irritates the crap out of me and it's like the longest tank top I have. So that's why I'm wearing this to cover my entire corset. The rest of them are kind of like crop top. And I don't want to, you know, half of my corset be like on the sheet pushing around. And anyways, just to keep it safe. But yeah, I know I look crazy. <laughs> so I was going to make like a whole video on what I'm about to read to you right now. Like a, like a short or a TikTok or something. But I just decided like I'm just going to read it to you guys now. Maybe I'll make a short later so other people can see too. But you guys are my real ones. So here we go. Back in 2013, when I first started my corset training journey, I was told by a few people that I should wear my corset to bed. I thought they were crazy and I told them I'd rather burn my corset than wear it to bed. Not really, but you get the idea. However, after doing some research and understanding that our bodies make huge changes during sleep, such as growth, digestion, and cell turnover, aka our bodies rebuild themselves i came to realize that these people were onto something wearing a corset to bed can seriously help mold and shape your body and you may achieve your results faster so document your journey measure every night before you put your corset on which i didn't do but oh well <laughs> over your corset after you've put it on and tightened it and in the morning when you take it off remember that our bodies rebuild rejuvenate and transform while we sleep i'm not saying i'm going to start wearing my corset to bed tonight Again, I wrote this, so whatever, I'm wearing it to bed. But I hope this motivates you to keep wearing yours to bed if you already are, or ponder the idea of starting. Take care, corset lover. Okay, one more thing I wanted to say is that I feel the need to, like, get on my grind. Because in August, I'm going to be going to a wedding, and it is possibly going to be televised. So I need to look snatched AF and better than the bride, obviously. Okay, this is seriously good night. Bye. Hi, good afternoon. It's 1.44 p.m. I don't know why you said that like that, but I slept with my corset on and it is like this now. I swear, if I'm not looking a fool on this channel, was it really me? <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, so it was like really easy to sleep in. Sorry, you can't see like everything. This freaking door is in the way. Hold on. I'm gonna tighten it up. Hopefully this cat, oh my God, get out of the way, please. Stop it. Okay, we're gonna tighten it up for a little. Today is the second day of my water fast. <sighs> Feeling low energy, like bodily wise. Like obviously I'm talking and I'm like, you know, it, sound, it doesn't sound like I have low energy, but with regard to like moving around and stuff, hell yeah, I have really low energy. But anywho, we're gonna tighten up the corset. Yes, Prince. Yeah. So I'm 
just gonna be hanging out, you know, chilling on the couch, not doing much today. Uh, yeah, because it's the second day of my water fast. Yesterday I was starving, and but today I can I can probably take this off actually. <laughs> but today I feel better. Uh, it's just that like all I'm thinking about is food. All I'm thinking about is what I'm gonna eat, and that's Thursday night. That's all I can think about, what I'm going to eat, everything. But I told my husband and I told myself too, I was like, we are not going to like, you know, go to freaking Taco Bell or something after we've done this water fast. You know, we're going to like get it together. You know, have, I want to break my fast with protein, maybe some vegetables, some fruit. I don't know yet. I'm just... Honestly, hungry and like literally anything sounds good. <laughs> Even you sound good, yummy pussy. Okay, guys, bye. Maybe I'm not going to take my tank off. Maybe I like this look. This is like so early 2000s look, but they had a long sleeve underneath the tank top. It's so tacky. Anyways, I wanted to tell you guys, like I was telling my husband yesterday and I was like, sometimes... You get these epiphanies and you think to yourself, is that even correct? Does that even sound right? But hear me out. So I feel like I have not been successful in my perspective with regard to my social media content creation and all that because I'm fat. Now hear me out. I know this is bad. There are, you know, overweight, curvy, fat people who are extremely successful, you know? I could give you a bunch of examples right now, but I'm not going to. The point I'm trying to make is that this is my story and this is what I think to be true. And as I previously stated in a past video, I believe that whatever I think is true. Like if I believe it, then it's going to be true. You know what I mean? It's going to happen. It's going to come into fruition. So yeah, I was just thinking that and I was like, I need to like seriously get my act together with regard to like my body because my body isn't necessarily holding me back per se, but I feel like me being fat is holding me back from accomplishing the success that I know, that I know, that I just know is going to come into fruition. And I know that's kind of like kind of cheesy, maybe even a little sad to say, but like it's my story, guys, and I'm here sharing you, sharing with you my story. So yeah, I'm done being fat. Like I'm literally done. And if you see me eating some trash, slap me, please. Okay, bye. Hey guys, I'm gonna be going on my walk right now. It's five twenty-one. I'm gonna. Oh my god, dude, this cat has been giving me a headache so much today. Anyways. I'm going to take off my corset and I'm going to put my waist trainer on and obviously change my shirt and everything like that. Let's see the final result after wearing it for quite some time. All right, so I'm going to put my waist trainer on, go for my hour-long walk, and then go to the gym later tonight. I hope you guys are all having great days, and if you are wearing your corset, awesome. If you're not, that's okay too. We all need breaks, but let's just remind ourselves that we don't have to always take like really long breaks. Like Let's take like a day or two break and then jump back in it. Bye. You guys, I give up. I can't do the water fast. I can't. And my waist trainer, I felt hella dizzy. Fasting is just not for me. Starving is just not for me. Hey guys, so after eating, uh, you know, I fasted for two days. I felt, I feel really, really nauseous. So I'm going to take my waist trainer off and probably just like take a shower and go to bed because I have another effing headache. Like, it's like in my neck and it goes up into my head. And you know what's weird is that for the past couple of days, you know, I've been telling you I've been having headaches and migraines. And that, the only thing that I changed was I started going to the gym. That's like the only thing I ch that changed. And I started this water fast after I started going to the gym. So 
I don't know. Whatever. This is the belly at the moment. We really don't care right now. I just want to feel better. Okay, bye.